Okay, I want to just uh, have you listen and hear, hopefully, what happens if the M prop is failed. So what I've done is disconnected it. So you have a faulty proportioning valve in the early model D6s, D4, D6, non-EVC 2.0, which we'll go over in a little bit. Uh, all of these engines, the fail safe is for the M prop, if it fails or the circuit fails, is to go to full fuel delivery. What that will do is that will cause the rail pressure to take off and go up to the maximum limit, which will open the pressure relief valve at the end of the fuel rail. You'll hear it pop off, and then the RPM will go up to about 1,000 RPM. So I'm going to start it up with an unplugged. And you can hear and listen, hopefully, to what it sounds like. You'll definitely hear the RPM go up, right? And then uh, we'll see what it sounds like. So here we go. So you definitely can hear that change when it pops off at idle. So if you had one and you started it up and it makes that sound, the alarm goes off, the end prop makes that noise, then you have an end prop failure. Or the circuit's bad, or the driver in the ECM. Then you have to pin out the harness to verify the harness isn't the problem. So the book will tell you, uh, test the end prop circuitry, start it up, back probe that through the breakout box, check your voltage potential, all right, and then see if you have anything there. If you do have frequency, voltage, duty cycle, then the uh, M-Prop may be a failed unit, but your ohms resistance test, one to two ohms will tell you that. If that uh, is the problem, you can change the M-Prop. If that is not the problem, then you need a new injection pump, which is a high pressure pump, which I showed you how to replace.